More live football to bring you on Trevor Sports. It's the Europa League semi-final, live from Old Trafford. It's Sports Night. Welcome back to Sports Night. That's right, we're like buses. You wait ages for live football and you get two in a week. Uh, the, the, second semi, uh, the second game we're bringing you tonight is the semi-final between Manchester United and Inter Milan. And Old Trafford is definitely buzzing for this. Europa League may be seen as a bit of the, uh, uh, the League Cup of European tournaments, but it's certainly not that case tonight. Both these sides are really up for this. Manchester United know realistically this is their path back into the UEFA Champions League. For next season, looking like they are going to finish fifth in this season. And Inter Milan themselves, while they're still challenging for the Scudetto, it might be uh, uh, important for them to get back into European prominence. It's been 10 years since they won a European trophy. Certain Josie Mourinho was in charge that night. Let's take you through the first leg at Old Trafford. It's our match commentator, Trevor Davis. So, the Europa League semi-finals, and there is the trophy that both these sides will be hoping to lift in a month's time. Manchester United know realistically this could be their path back to Champions League football, but their old European nemesis into Milan, a team made up of ex-Premier League stars Alexis Sanchez, Romelu Lukaku, and former Tottenham tormentor Christian Eriksen. A side which Manchester United to know if they're under their true renaissance under Ole Gunnar Solskjaer will be the big test for them. However, for Manchester United, they know a second cup final is potentially a, a way for them. Well, such is an occasion as this. Manchester United and Old Trafford has a real buzz around it. It is a huge European night and this is the side that Ole Gunnar Solskjaer goes with. Reverting back to an old 4-4-2 formation with Martial and Lingard on the wings, Fred's partnering Pogba and Bruno Fernandes expected to give him a free roll in behind Marcus Rashford. Into Milan, it is Diego Godin's side that will lead the attack with Lukaku and Sanchez of former Manchester United. There's so many stories to be told here, but Manchester United on the way to their famous win in 1999. Blew the opposition away, 2-0. Can they do something similar tonight to take a lead to the San Zero? It's Victor Lindelof straight away. Now here's Fred. Saka looking for a long hopeful ball. Eriksen. Completely different formations for both sides tonight, but expect Manchester United. They've uh, shown more success in recent times by playing more of that wide outlet. Diego Godin, one of the uh, top 11 footballers in the World Cup in Russia, despite his side only getting to the quarterfinals. How the performance is going. His was the best in the least amount of games. And he's the skipper tonight. This is the perfect setup for an old fashioned Italian defensive job. Luke Shaw getting ahead of his former teammates. Alexis Sanchez is only out on loan, mind you. He'll return to Old Trafford next season. Andre Candreva. England fans may remember him very well. The night in Brazil in which he tormented England. Pogba. 
Pass that way to Martial. Here's Pogba. Fred. Lingard. Aaron Wan Bissaka. Deep cross looking for Rashford. Headed away. Martial into the space. Puts it in for Rashford. But the header lacks the direction necessary to cause Handanovic any real problems. Skriniar's header. Martial's ball back in. Rashford getting there. And not starting. Skriniar looking for Brozovic, the Croatian maestro. Had a fabulous performance in the World Cup. Eriksson. Arrival from January from Tottenham Hotspur. We'll be very familiar with him. Here's Brozovic. Barella. Good pass that way to Eriksson. He's unable to keep it in control. Very unlike the Danish midfielder. Well, there's a third former Manchester United player available for Inter Milan. That, of course, is Ashley Young, who was the Manchester United captain at the start of this season. Interesting to see if he features tonight. There's so many stories, and here is one. One Bissaka's cross, headed away. He'll come as far as Fred. Pogba. Bruno Fernandes enjoying that freer roll. Pogba, interception. The Sanchez, Lukaku charging forwards. Now here is Lukaku. Good turn by Lukaku. Excellent work through him against Lindelof. Pass back out to Sanchez. It's off the post and away. A huge let off for Manchester United, but what a brilliant turn by Lukaku. One Misaka. Bruno Fernandez into Rashford. Rashford goes out wide to Anthony Martial. Manchester United are on the counter attack at the moment. Here's Anthony Martial. Rashford. Lingard. Over the bar. By heavens, I thought Alexis Sanchez's shot was in. It's hit the inside of the post and rolled away from goal. Big let off for Manchester United. Who are playing, truth be told, a very, very good Inter Milan side. Here's Ericsson. Looking for Can Driver, but the pass is short and picked up by Martial. Rashford. Martial. Enjoying that roll on that left wing position. Pass into Rashford. Good turn by Rashford. Good strength by Rashford. But he's not able to get the shooting opportunity away. Swarmed there by Inter Milan defenders. But good work by Rashford. And good strength shown. Pogba. Lingard. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. Pogba goes out wide to Lingard. Good touch. Jesse Lingard for Manchester United. Oh, he couldn't find the cross. He couldn't find the cross. Ericsson. Lukaku. Barella. Ericsson. Excellent pass out wide to Kandreva. Good control. Brozovic. Kandreva. Looking towards Lukaku. Away by Aaron Wambasaka. Martial clears. Rashford will pick the ball up. Bruno Fernandes charging ahead of him. He's going to need support. Luke Shaw's arriving. Pogba. United look quite comfortable on the ball. Pogba was searching ball towards Martial. Barella. Stefan de Ridge. Here's Diego Godin. Eriksson. That pass across to Kandreva's been a real um, statement of Inter Milan's Arsenal tonight. Ability to switch play. They believe that's going to be the key to unlocking this Manchester United defence. Gagliardini. Gladini's ball into Ericsson. Dangerous looking cross. Headed away by Harry Maguire. 
And Can Driver was there. There was a collision. Referees unmoved. There will be no spot kick. Here's Pogba. Still Pogba. Luke Shaw up against Brozovic. Shaw's cross. It's been picked up by Barella to clear, then Brozovic to play it into Alexis Sanchez. And this is where Inter Milan are dangerous at the moment. Eriksen is over here on the near side. Now it's Christian Eriksen with lots of time and space. Can he provide an opportunity? Eriksen again. Spent too long, but good defending by Aaron Wambasaka. Barella. Here's Brozovic. Barella. Lukaku. Sanchez. Well, it was a nice height for David De Gea, but the save still had to be made. And for Manchester United, might be worrying times because Inter Milan are having the better of the play at the moment. Christian Eriksen to take the corner. Five in the box for Inter Milan. Eventually it's gone away. Here is Codine. Charges forward. Gagliardini. Lukaku. Eriksen. Lukaku! It was always rising. And Manchester United again are pleased that their former centre forwards shooting boots are off they are giving into Milan far too much time maybe not long away until there is a goal scoring opportunity here's Victor Lindelof Aaron Wan-Bissaka oh that was poor lost it should have controlled it from there Lukaku will take the throw quickly Eriksen Sanchez good pass back out to Christian Eriksen Ericsson. This is looking cross towards Lukaku. Headed away. Back is Barella. Gigladini. Barella. Here's Brozovic. It's a shooting opportunity for Brozovic. And David De Gea responds. And a half that has uh, flown by. It's turning out to be that International have definitely had the better of the play in the first half at Old Trafford. How an away goal could be so crucial. Ericsson over the corner. Short to Barella. Barella's cross. Oh, just wide from Brozovic. And it was good work, good cross in the end. Brozovic that threw himself at that. And it's headed just over. Ericsson will take the corner. Real pressure for Manchester United to survive. Lindelof being able to get ahead and clear the ball away. Martial will keep the ball in. Harry Maguire. Feel here Manchester United just need a bit of possession just before half time. Bruno Fernandes. First time ball into Marcus Rashford. Rashford trying to look for Fernandes and Diego Godin was able to tuck that and deal with that very easily. Here's Candreva. Good pass by Candreva to Sanchez. Two over on the near side for Inter Milan. It's a deep cross towards Lukaku. Aaron Wambasaka does very well there. It's even gone out for a throw in. One minute of time added on. Signaled at the end of this first half. We approach the first quarter of this semi final. Ericsson been absolutely stunning time to score if Inter Milan can manage it Gigladini looking for Candreva who's kept it in cross looking towards Lukaku who got there good save good good save I'm sure that's a mixture of Doha De Gea in the post 
but that's why it's 0-0. Uh, lots to improve for Manchester United. In that first half, they've had two attempts, but into Milan, they're 6-3 to three on target. They've dominated this match thus far. And only the inside of the post and a very good save by David De Gea has kept the score down at 0-0. Well, I don't know if Inter Milan ha have decided to give Manchester United the tie, but I've never seen more let-offs in my life in a contest. My goodness heavens, Manchester United are riding their luck tonight. But, as the old saying goes, you need a bit of luck to win a title, and that's what Manchester United will hope for as second half. But just to remind you of what we've got coming up for you soon... Got cover of the Masters on Grandstand. We've got live coverage of the final day's play. So if you want to see the final two, we're going to be following them as they're around through Augusta, Georgia on Grandstand. But the second half of this Europa League uh, semi-final, first leg to come, back to the company of Mr. Trevor Davis. Well, well we've seen it, an improvement in Manchester United. We've been outplayed by Inter Milan thus far. Much to ponder in the tactics what Ogun and Solskjaer was looking for today. This evening in Old Trafford, Manchester United have been second best. Oh, Lukaku through ball through the middle. And Sanchez hits the post again. And Lukaku scores, but it's offside. The whistle and the flag went up straight away. Another fabulous bit of luck for Manchester United in this game. Lukaku is furious, he thought he'd scored against his former side. Really should have from the first instance that Sanchez had the ball. And Lukaku tapped home, but it was offside. And referee made the signal very early. But what a start to the second half for Manchester United. Fred does win that. Out wide. Now here's Rashford. Now plays in Anthony Martial. He loses it. Sanchez. So Inter Milan is so dangerous here in the game. And that's a poor ball to give away. Now a chance in. Marcos Rashford is in behind. Rashford's ball across. Was looking towards Bruno Fernandes. Much better from the Red Devils. Fred. Now here is Lingard. Lingard's ball is aiming towards Rashford. Who did get the header across goal. But thankfully it was cleared away. Skriniar. Looking for Sanchez. Fred is across. Jesse Lingard. Now it's Bruno Fernandes. Now it's Anthony Martial. Tried to play it back to Bruno Fernandes. I think Manchester United have shown a bit more intent at the start of this second half. Maybe the uh, disallowed goals woken them up just a little bit more. Danovic yet to truly been uh, testing to a meaningful bit of action in this game thus far Harry Maguire Pogba Luke Shaw goes inside towards Rashford who tries to look for Jesse Lingard and Danovic's clearance Here is Pogba. Fred. Uh, he didn't quite have the options in midfield required. And loses it. And uh, good interception and pass by Lindelof. Fred, better from Manchester United. One touch football's making a difference. This is Rashford. Oh, he nearly made a huge difference. The best chance Manchester United have had in the match. Lingard's ball in, came back to Fred's, opened up for Marcus Rashford. This shot, he got it to loop. But I was unlucky. Lukaku looking for this. Sanchez, good header. This is Candreva. Still Antonio Candreva. Pogba, back there defending. Lindelof to Maguire. Now 
here's Luke Shaw. Stefan Davic. 71,000 fans inside Old Trafford tonight. Their best attendance for a Europa League match this season. And it's definitely opened up into a really meaningful contest thus far. Here's Fred for Manchester United. Pass up wide to Pogba. He's in acres of space. And he's got Luke Shaw arriving to support him. Here is Luke Shaw. Can he provide a cross? Manchester United have the throw. Shaw's throw to Pogba. United trying to find an opportunity through. Bruno Fernandes turning in the area. Oh, it's a good best of deflection. Back to Pogba. Martial. Luke Shaw. Pogba inside the channel if he can find him. Cuts inside Luke Shaw. Back to Fred. Run being made through the middle is by Rashford. And now it's Fred. Tried to play it through for Bruno Fernandes. Cleared away by Eriksen. Only as far as Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Header back into Lingard. Manchester United putting into Milan under real pressure for the first time in this match. Here's Fred. Lingard. Wan-Bissaka. How a lead will help for Manchester United when they go to the centre next Wednesday. Fred. ball was broken away and it's come forward to Lukaku just as such how a lead would make this trip all the more interesting for Inter Milan when they ideally would be in a position to be favourites with a lead heading into their home grounds excellent pressure from Manchester United but no goal to show from it thus far Inter Milan though let off after let off as far as Manchester United are concerned they miss golden opportunities they have scored it hasn't counted well, this cross counts it's in towards Paul Pogba cleared away by Ericsson it's an excellent clearance to Sanchez and Lukaku who are combining really well now this is Antonio Candreva into Milan with the opportunity to move forward for Antonio Candreva number 987 Maguire picks out a poor cross it has to be said Fred Good pass by Fred to play in Anthony Martial who's got space just Rashford in the area Bruno Fernandes arriving on the far side as well here's Anthony Martial his cross is looking towards Rashford headed away by Skriniar he'll come back to Luke Shaw Luke Shaw crosses right footed header away is there again oh Anthony Martial just stole Candreva just as he was about to clear anything more exciting uh goal of straws we've had perhaps in Europe this season Bruno Fernandes still Bruno Fernandes it was blocked it's Marcio it's back out wide it's Luke Shaw for Manchester United three in the box to aim for it's still Luke Shaw he's going all the way is he and somehow it's got away and it's a goal kick well offside there Martial just needed a bit more quality in the decision making Bruno Fernandes is departing, as is Martial for Igalo. One matter is on for Manchester United. Fresh legs for the final 10 minutes. Luke Shaw and Christian Eriksen both with three attempted crosses, none of which has gone to an opponent. This is Igalo. Mata. Igalo. Pogba. Now it's Martial. Loses the ball. Candreva. pass inside to Sanchez and now this is Lukaku Barella option to his left option to his right in Lukaku good work by Luke Shaw excellent work by Luke Shaw great clearance good control by Paul Pogba by heavens that was an important bit of defending by Luke Shaw David Tejaia to Lindelof Fred under pressure straight away on Bissaka. Now Jesse Lingard. It's 
there to be a twist in the tail of this match. Lingard getting the hero, Gagliardini. This is Lingard. His cross has gone out to a Manchester United corner. Well, it's their time of night, Manchester United, to grab something in Europe. 25 years of doing this. Pogba's corner. Oh, it was so close. And Danovic wonders where were his defenders. And in the end, Fred's header was off target. Gagliardini has been replaced by Sensi for Inter Milan. In the second half, Manchester United's possession and dominance of the game has shown because they have far more of the ball. Anthony Martial. Pogba. Tough task for a two-man midfield tonight. We've not seen that for a while. Two have been able to play it quite nicely. Tired pass there, I think, from Anthony Martial. Igalo chasing the ball. Skriniar, who's had a very good game. Stefan De Vrij. Inter Milan, I think, are prepared to see the clock out. Eriksen. Just a minute of time added on. Here's Sanchez. Oh, here's Eriksen. Danger here for Manchester United. Nervous minute to defend against. Eriksen's cross. Oh, in towards Lukaku. And it does finish nil-nil. Not an ideal result, but Manchester United will have to win away from home in Europe. Something they've not done in, in Milan for a long time. So it's a nil nil at full time and all to play for when the two sides go to the San Siro in six days time. Uh, a game which you can see exclusively live uh, with us. So don't go anywhere. But as things stand tonight, Solskjaer might be behind the wheel. But today it looks as if Man United have slightly stalled. Inter Milan are surely the odds on favourites to go through. And surely that's Manchester United season over. Is it? Good night.